Greetings, dear IAU and present today with us on this special day. I am Ermina Carmen Raescu, President of Women Entrepreneur Council, Country Director IAU Romania and Board Member IAU. I am a woman, I have quality, I have flaws. I'm like you, woman from all over the world. I believe that a strong woman and this, uh, in a strong woman and this, um, show is about you, beautiful and unique woman, about you and for you. First of all, I would like to, uh, thanks to the team IAU. Yes, behind every project, there is a team, a great team with common goals to bring education to the homes of you, according to the vision of the IAU founder, Sir Piyosh Pandit. Thank you, Sir, for always your support, your vision, uh, in education is unique, uh, real, creative, and brilliant mind. Hats off IIU for your great work. I think that in life, it is not only the destination that is important, but also the journey. It is even more beautiful when it's built with dedication, involvement, and smiles. Remember this always. To be a strong woman means to have the courage to fight for what you want and for what you believe, this big, the fear and risk to which you expose yourself. You may get the results you want or you may not get them, but the very fact that you take this risk makes you a strong woman. To be a strong woman means to always listen to your heart, even when it seems that everything around you is against you. It's not always easy to do what you want or what you feel, but the reward is as well. When you say woman, you mean a universe. Woman is life. I think every woman can feel beautiful in her own way. One in sneakers maybe, uh, another on heels, one in dress, another in jeans. Today is a different day. Why? We will have a special guest. He is no other than country director, IAU Morocco. Welcome. Anas. Thank you so much, there, Ermina. And uh, that was a very, very beautiful introduction, by the way. And uh, as always, it's a great, great pleasure to be with you and to, uh, to provide whatever is necessary to move forward with this great vision of uh, Dr. Fayouj. Thank you so much, and I'm glad to be here. First of all, Anas, was your birthday recently? Happy birthday. We, the team IIU, we wish you a long life full of happiness and success with your loved one. Happy birthday. Thank you so much, my dear. Thank you so much, my dear. You are really, it's, it's really making me warm. Yes. I chose yes, you. Go ahead. Yeah, we go. I chose you because you're open mind, because you have an open mind. You, you know to make fun of any situation, in any situation. Um, you are ready for my challenge, for my questions? I think I am. Okay. What qualities should the ideal woman have for you? The ideal qualities yes. that a woman should have. Uh, first of all, respect. Respect. Um, uh, loyalty and... Uh, and this is a big thing for me, which is which which I'm really looking for in a woman. Uh, I'm looking for a woman that's really spiritually connected with her with her with her inner self. For me, this is a very very big thing. And you did say it in your introduction to listen to your heart. And we cannot we cannot really listen to our hearts unless we uh, we uh, we are connected with our true selves. And that's and that's that's a very big part uh, that, that that I'm that I'm looking for in a world. spirituality. Exactly, exactly. Great answer. Great answer. Anas, have you ever wondered why women ask for a man opinion about a certain thing, but the fact just want to agree with them? Uh, for example, should I wear that uh, green dress? Uh, do you think I look gorgeous today? 
What do you think about this? They uh, want well, attention or what? They, they, they are seeking for attention, of course, they want attention and they want to, uh, to feel or to be or to be perceived or to be to be at the center of, uh, of the moment when she's with her with her man. So it's like um, it's like she wants to be uh, she wants to be um, uh, she wants to acquire his full attention. And besides of that, uh, maybe she asked that because she needs to know uh, more about uh, the man with her through the answer he's going to provide her through those questions. Maybe she's not looking for the for for the answer itself, but she's looking on how he's going to answer, and she's got to 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 mingle around with her with his answers, so to to know better how his mind works and what he likes and not and stuff like that. I think I think that that, that that's why, totally or just a part agree. of it. Totally agree. Great, great. You do great. You do great. Your answer is great. Uh, please and those presenting Facebook Live to answer in chat. Your opinion is so important to us. I will read after the talk show. Do you think there are soulmates in this world? You talk about connection, connection of soul. Are those souls who find themselves in a certain moment lucky? Do you believe in this? Uh, definitely, definitely, absolutely, 100%. I do believe in that. I do believe that uh, there are soulmates. And I do believe that whenever, I mean, you get to be super lucky and it has a lot with your, with your, with your, um, with your state of deservedness. So uh, when you meet your soulmate, you are extremely beyond, I mean, beyond measures uh, that you're lucky. So I do believe in it. And I'm 100% sure that you are super lucky if you meet your soulmate in this life. You make part from this uh, circle of uh, lucky people? You find your soulmate? Uh, I don't think I don't think I'm there yet, but I have a feeling that somehow it's like a it's like a cosmic circle is is it's 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 getting to to an end for me. So I'm thinking that um, in this period, I get I get this feeling and I got it and I got it by the uh, the the beginning of the year during my birthday. So I got this. This feeling that I will be finding my soulmate during this year, I think. I think I'm so. I'm sure about that. And you deserve this. You deserve this. Thank you so much, my dear. Thank you so much. And be there's my heart. Imprevisible, imprevisible. I don't know. <laughs> Let me see what I will ask you. Um, mm -hmm. Yes. They say that behind a uh, successful man is a strong woman. We hear us this all day. But behind a successful woman, she can be inquired by a woman, by a man. Why yes, you? definitely. Yes, yes, hundred percent. Because um, she could, she, for example, uh, a woman she could do really good in her career, for example. But career it is just a one facet of of our lives. It's not the whole thing. So believe me, if she wants to feel that entire fulfillment, that that. That, that holistic kind of satisfaction she needs. She needs really a man that believes in her, in, in her, in her, in her vision, that believes in her uh, belief system, value structure that she got and empower her. That will, that will, I mean, put her on a very, very high pedestal to do and to reach very, very um, epic heights in her career and her, in her, in her life in general. So 100%. Exactly. And as do you think that um, uh, if a woman or a man cry in a moment, it's a sign of weakness? I don't think this. Uh, 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 the question was, is it, is it a sign of weakness? Yes. If a man or a woman cry in a moment, yes, we have all a moment of weakness. Do you think this is a sign yes. that it's a person, a weak person? Or no, no, I don't, I don't. With. He's a very normal person and crying is a very, is a very uh, healthy process through which you can really get rid of a lot of anger, a lot of bad emotions through crying, simply that. And when you cry, and by the way, people that don't really cry, they're, they're for me, they're the, um, the alienated um, beings. I mean, they're the, the weak one because 
you don't cry, something is really wrong with you. I mean, definitely something is wrong with you if you don't cry. So for me, crying is a good thing. It's a good process. And uh, it helps really uh, get rid of a lot of burdens. Excellent. And just like that, in, in that moment. Excellent. So no weakness. Great, great, great. Because I discussed about this in uh, the last uh, talk show, exactly about this mm -hmm. uh, subject. What is the craziest thing that you want to try, that you want to do? The craziest thing that I want to do? You want to well, jump from uh, a big building? No. <laughs> Uh, apart apart from that, I had I had a bucket list, but the craziest thing I'm I'm I'm, I'm thinking of is to I, I would like to experience the uh, the uh, the ayahuasca experience in the Amazon. Great! Wow. So so that's 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 something really I've been pondering on lately. I mean the the last year so i'm um, really that's that's for me the craziest thing i want to experience so i want to experience that the ay ayahuasca experience with the uh, indigenous people of the amazon so that would be it it will be i'm sure that will be inshallah yes will be because you are a strong person will be um thank you so much what quality does a man love or admire most in a woman two qualities Okay, so uh, I'm gonna give you two qualities. It's a very hard um, to to sum it up because it depends on the man. Yes. Plus, it depends on how 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 culturally programmed he is. So, uh, I would I would say I would say if it's two most two most uh, the, the two qualities that are men looking for and women are loyalty. That will be the first one. Loyalty and and respect. I guess loyalty and respect. Great, great. Almost, I want to make tic tac tic tac. <laughs> um, Anas, you <laughs> your answer are great. Um, you are a successful man. Uh, how was your road to success? Easy. Or with trip, or, or you maybe you has a bad period in your life. That's a very great question, and um, yes, I mean it's 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 hard to say uh, to put it to put it in a in a very simple uh, kind of uh, sentence. But I would say that it was not easy. Definitely, it's not easy. The thing is, or the wisest. Um, uh, ones that wants to go through that uh, or choose to go down that path should really look for ways to make things simple. They're not easy. They will never be easy. This is this is kind of how the universe is 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 testing you. Okay. It's not going to be easy. But the thing is, the more you make things simple, because um, we tend to we tend really to um, uh, to confuse simplicity with uh, easiness, with ease. Uh, simple, simple doesn't mean it's easy. It's gonna be simple, and the more you put um, a very simple mindset approach to things, the more the difficulty or the things that you're gonna go through in the process are going to. Um, uh, are going to be less, let's say, less chaotic. Exactly. So uh, for me, for me, it was that, and uh, uh, it was not that easy. I'm still on the road, and um, uh, being 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 a kind of a person that I am, um, I am more of a perfectionist person. So for me to understand that was person. a very big I'm treasure happy. because I. Uh, thank you so much, my dear. Thank you so much. And uh, that was a very, for me, that was a very big thing because I used to really uh, complicate things. So, and I'm, and I'm, and I'm, and I'm looking on, on multiple inputs at the same time and trying to, uh, to, to, to overcomplicate the, the process. So when I understand that, I was, that, that was a very big hit into my head. The more I put things in a very simple perspective, it's not going to be easy, but at least 
when 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 you, when you put it on a simple perspective, it gives you it gives you a certain kind of let's say clarity and comfort. Let's say that clarity and comfort. Exactly. Do you believe in the equality between men and women? Equality between men and women. That's Is a that very. That? That's a very. Uh, that's a very. I do believe in quality. I do believe in it, but in certain fields, because if we if we take, for example, a field where where a more uh, a more uh, um, a field of work that requires more physical strength and or a masculine kind of attitude, so it will be unfair to uh, say we're going to make uh, in this field we're going to make women and men equal. This is not fair for the woman. But for the fields where uh, there is no, uh, there is no, for example, there is no um, physical uh, uh, requirement for the job, or it's not really, uh, it's not really that um, uh, it doesn't require physical uh, attributes. So those fields, I do believe that there should be equality between men and women. At all costs. So it depends on the field, but I do believe in it. And also, there are some fields that are strictly restricted to women. When a man goes there, it's unfair for him also to say we're going to be equal in this. Exactly. Exactly. And as if you could send a message to women, for women, to all women around the world, what you will say in 20 seconds? 20 seconds. Okay. Um, uh, hello, beautiful, uh, beautiful creatures, beautiful beings. Uh, you are the light. You are uh, you are the life itself. You represent uh, the universe itself. So uh, be proud of yourself. Please, please connect with your inner self. Please, please, please avoid, avoid, and try to stay away from toxic whatever it is, because um, uh, you are just great as you are. Yes. So please, please do that. Perfect. Listen to Anas, my dear ladies, a great message, a great message for you. And Anas, I can have a secondary question. Yeah, what go ahead. do you think, because we talk about the problem of women, but what do you think are the main problems faced by men in the world at the moment? The word and the moment in general, again, uh, again, it's it's really hard because you see it depends on which part of the globe we are talking about. But if we say overall, main challenges faced by women are stereotypes, are probably the um, uh, the um, the blind, the blind, um, unfair patriarchy, and uh, what else? Well, I, I guess these two are the most common challenges faced by women all over the globe. But again, it depends on which part of the globe we are speaking of. So it's really hard to. Uh, to kind of mix all the women from all places at the same time and give those uh, and give specific challenges faced by women. So I think those two are, are are the main two challenges faced by women all over the globe. Perfect answers. Perfect answer. I knew this. I knew that we, you will give me the perfect answer for all my questions. Thank you, <laughs> Thank Thank you, you. so much, dear Anas, for your precious presence today in Spin Your Life with IIU. The time passed so, so rapidly. You are truly oh, yes. a special person and a great Thank you so much. director. Thank you. Thank you. It was a pleasure to have you in Spin Your Life. And thank you all for thank joining you. us today. God bless you all. I hope you feel good with us. Uh, if you want to say a few words for audience, you are welcome, Anas. All right, thank you. Dear audience, thank you so much for making uh, 
uh, for taking the time to be with us here today. Uh, I mean, you, I, I, I'm sure that you had fun, you had some information, and you had the chance to be with the beautiful Ermina. So uh, you should be, you should be here. Huh? And uh, uh, I can't wait to to see you again in another IIU event. And um, and thank you, thank you for your time. Thank you so much. It was a really pleasure and stay here because you will have a surprise, a musical surprise. Get to break the patterns, to believe in your dreams and to clean them the wine infinity. If that is where that you will find their fourth man. Dare to be yourself. IAU always celebrate you. Be the change with IAU. Be a strong voice with IAU. Dare to always be a source of love, dear woman of inspiration, of beauty, of kindness, of harmony. Dare to love and to be loved. Be happy. Think always of these words of Bodhya. In the heart of the woman are reflected gracefully the sweetest, the noblest feelings and passion of humanity. And now let's end this beautiful moment in the rhythm of a cheerful song of the musician and founder, director, CEO at Quantum Educational Sol Solution, Rish Akaria from India. Thank you so much, Rish, for this musical gift. Are you ready, Anas, to listen to your Yes, music? I am. Okay. That's really let's, great. Let's, yeah. For you, you can dance. I love to dance.
That was a very great, great one. Thank you so much. Give it this song, give you energy. Hmm? It's true. Yes, or... I, I, it's, it is true. It's Kashmir by Led Zeppelin. I yes. love the song. I love to this love song. It. It's full of energy and post positive energy. Thank you yes, so much yes, again. Indeed. Thank you so much. Thank I you. wish that all your dreams to become reality, to hear uh, news from you that you are in Amazon, that you are in Alaska. I will be happy thank for you. you. And um, thank you so much. Thank you. Um, see you soon again in Spin Your Life with IIU Talk Show, a show in which we have unique West, a show that I hope uh, has found its place in your soul. Don't forget, please, your soul is the house of infinity. And don't forget to be yourself is most important. Thank you so much, Anas. Goodbye to all. Thank you so much. All the blessings. Bye bye. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Thank you.